Oh, we know what to do. Beat him up. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna get this one, but. No, no. Didn't get him just, in t just a sh little bit short. Oh, really? Really, we have to use another life bottle? Okay. What? That didn't work. Yeah, try harder! Got him. Oh my god. Are we done? Are we done fighting the brothers and sisters of the fun? <laughs> you actually stood up to the both of us together. I'm impressed. Mm -hmm. I'll accept my loss gracefully and not put on any airs. You're passable. I'll grant you that much. If that's not putting on airs, what is? In truth, it might have been a different outcome entirely if we had fought you in your realm. Our victory is certainly no reason for conceit. Absolutely. You were both worthy opponents. Mm-hmm. I'd hardly call that resounding praise. Still, thanks for giving us this time together. Edna. Edna. Judging from the way you're talking, are you from the same world, but different times? I suppose we are. I'd sooner not bore you with the tedious details, though. I don't know the hows or whys of it. But this is some kind of warped space that connects different worlds and times. Its existence is much to do with a mistake born of our own world. I apologize for dragging you into this mess. Hey, I got to see my sister. You know what they say about dark clouds and silver linings. You need this, right? Go on, take it. Another key! You could always tag along with us if you wanted. You guys would definitely liven things up. I appreciate the offer, but we've got business of our own to take care of back home. Indeed. I'm going back eventually, but in the meantime, I've got tons of catching up to do. I'm not sure we'll even get to keep our memories from here after we leave, but... I'm glad I got to see my brother. So am I. Hey. All right, we don't talk With to them. This, I can become even stronger. Cuz that's how we get into a fight. <laughs> I don't need another fight on my hands. We can't fast travel from here, can we? Oh, we can. I'm just an idiot. I'm just dumb. <laughs> We've reached our destination. Okay. Uh, forge weapons, craft weapon. Yes. Oh, we don't have enough for these two, but we can get this one. Should help out just a tad bit. Uh, we need gloaming crystals. I'm impressed how well balanced this thing is. Uh, we also need to buy gels. Mm. 
Oh shit. Well, already sold. <laughs> All right. Did we really just spend that much money? Yes, we did. Uh, yeah, we need to rest. <laughs> Ba 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 Shall we get moving? Yes. Uh, first skills. We have a lot of skills. Do we? <laughs> Another one down. Okay, you have this has one left, so we'll do that one. Good. Is there nothing? Huh. Da. Whoops. All right. We'll fix that in just a second. Oh, what? One more area to go, and then we're done. And then we have that other quest, and then we're done. Done. Looks like we do 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 made it here in one piece. And hopefully we don't get our butt whooped again. God, this is such a good game. And I'm gonna be so upset when we're done with this game. Vesper Rift. I wonder what we're gonna find in Vesper. Tells me I need to save this. Hello? That's a baby. <laughs> Why is there a baby behind us? Human, here of all places. The fuck are you? Is he floating? Not a person. He's more like a mass of astral energy. That sounds a lot like a great astral spirit. Uh huh. How predictable. Applying simple minded molds to others. I doubt he's a great astral spirit, but there is something alien about him. <laughs> if anything, you're alien to your own realm. You feign comfort with fate, all the while bearing claws at destiny. You remind me of a certain race. Sorry, I haven't, I, I haven't got your name yet, creepy Mewtwo-looking creature. Of energy. <laughs> Disgraceful, all of it. Hmm. Sounds like someone has it in for us. As, yeah. Say, there's supposed to be six keys, right? And this is the sixth area. 
This must be our last stop. Dun dun dun. Be careful. This one's not like the others we've run into. You know, Edna mentioned being invited here. I'd figured it was the researchers doing, but what if there was something else in play? I'm more disturbed by the you baby in the background. That's anyone's presumption. Somehow I doubt he'd give us a straight answer if we asked. I'll give you the courtesy of my name. I am the great spirit Kronos, ruler of time and space. And now I shall demonstrate my power. Okay! Oh, 95. I've never felt power so Ah, we can beat you! Especially when you keep when you're a walking time clock. Oh, we need to swap. I already know this. I just realized that these two are out, and there are mob killers. Thank you. Would you like to sit down? Kronos? Sit down and talk about- Okay, you can just- I was gonna say, can we get a mystic around you? Please? Yeah, you stay down. You stay down, time thingy. We will have enough, we'll have none of this. Oh lord. I I have a feeling he has art, so we're not using Rinvel's stuff. Just just on the off chance. He seems like the guy who carries arts. <laughs> sit down again? He is toying with you, yet yeah, literally. He's just standing there. <laughs> Hi! No. Oh, Jesus! I can play the do I can play keep away again. Or not. I, I keep away, right? Playing keep away. While while don't let me re resist. There we go. Hi. He is a hundred percent toy. But we're winning, maybe. We'll see. Bad stuff might happen later on when we have to half pass the halfway point. But we'll see. Sit down. Come on. Oh, Jesus. Just had to get away just a bit, just for a breather. All yours. I was a fool. Uh oh. Uh oh. Here we go. I you too. How? Like this? Of your life has reached it then. 
Oh lord almighty. Running, running, running. <laughs> You know what? I actually expected words from his from his ultimate. I expected what? He said, "Prepare to be judged." Boy, do you know who I am? <laughs> <laughs> oh, if we bore you, I'm sorry. We'll deal with it. Oh, okay. Master of time, I see. Yep. Mm hmm. Cut it, stopping time. How did that work out for you? <laughs> he stopped, literally, stopped time. How is this a fair fight? <laughs> you can stop time! Worthless! <laughs> Can't use dicks for yourself. Oh, d really? I didn't know that. Ah, uh, I'm sorry. There, should be good. Good to know. <laughs> Thank you, cat. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah, stop time. You jerk. Thanks, cat. Oh, I'm stunned. This is... You know, he hasn't used arts. He has stopped time, though. Which means this goes off. We start using this now. Bye! Bye! Alright. Putting a spider on me. Ow, ow. Oh. Oh, now it does damage. Having fun there. That was rude. Literally stop time. You're a pushover, master of time and space. Ha! What a pushover! Uh-oh. 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 <laughs> oh no. Oh no no no. Oh fuck me. Well, I died. Car, we're gonna slap you. Shush! I got this, I got this, we'll be fine. It's all fine. Rez, please. Thank you. Hi! No, 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 no. I don't think Karma's gonna slap me. Karma's been good to me. Car actually, no, Karma's been really cruel to me. <laughs> I've done a dealt with a lot today already. This might be my grace grace point. Oh, he's going off again. Up, oh, time to run. <laughs> Time to dodge! Time to dodge! Time to dodge! <laughs> Sit down. 
takes it down. <laughs> master of time and space, my ass. <sighs> I'll show you, master of my blade. <laughs> what a push up. Uh oh. Thank you. Okay, it's two up. I can play the dodging game again. Oh, he's a thousand left. Come on. Oh, fuck me. Of course you stop time. Oh, Jesus. I warned you about karma. Well, can't stop this one, can you? That will keep us alive just a bit. <laughs> Three thousand. Fine, fine. I'll res. I'll do it myself. Oh, I can't. Um, uh, hmm. Problems. Oh, I could, but do I want to? Yeah, sure. He's so so close. Car almost got me. Goodbye, Master of Time and Space, whoever you are. Good riddance. <laughs> Jerk. What quaint arts you use. Oh, is there a round two? He's healing? Steven, I hate you. Not quite. I turned back time to be precise. <laughs> you do control time and space. <laughs> if I had to fight a round two, you, I don't like you, Steven. <laughs> you get timed out. Who made it. Nor was it Origin or Maxwell. So there's a world unrelated to the three primordial great spirits. Get alive a thousand people before. Primordial? <laughs> do you mean to tell us you have the power to create worlds? You may make of me what you will. Another great spirit, and another fine mess. I strongly recommend that research into doorways through time and space should be strictly forbidden. I agree. Ah, but what are rules to a species that insists on ignoring history's lessons? Not wrong. The people of your realm will learn of this place, and they will use it to rob and exploit other worlds. That's... True. They are driven by pure desire. They fob off their burdens on others, all without reflecting upon what comes of it. Let's fob off. To hell with this. We've torn down every barrier in front of us, but we know better than to call it good there. Are we doing it again? We'll build a world where people can coexist and walk hand in hand, and we won't give up until Oscar we Oscar speech moment! Yeah, we're ready to put in the work to change. I'll make sure this research gets called off. You have my word on that. I suppose this is another trait that your species shares. <laughs> you do me with the giant owl. Time. See to it that this absurd research is ended. All right, Kronos. We understand. But if you don't come back, if you don't abide by this, we'll come back and kick your ass again. To abuse the gateway, to interfere with our world. I will cast them into the time-space rift, where they will wander the void forevermore. We beat you once, we can beat you again. No one can cheer, pal. <laughs> I'm pushing it. We'll see to it that that never happens. You'll see from up there on your throne. <laughs> I 
I am not talking to Crow. I am not talking to him. Oh, level 90. Hi! You! Who opened the rift? No! Stop! Geki, <laughs> <laughs> thank you. You've done me great service. Yes. It wasn't quite like you described, though. It wasn't? How so? Well, you ran to people from other words, worlds there. Hmm, perhaps we're caught in, a, in the world's moment of segment, segmentation and connection. Fascinating. Mm -hmm. Fascinating is not the word I'd use. We create problems for them, and there might be connections to even more dangerous worlds. I think you should call your research off. Right. Great, this gate would be better off closed. The other side of the gate holds snippets of each world. They should return to normal as the astral energy here huh? dwindles. Wait, the astral energy is dwindling? Yes. I've been taking continual measurements, and I've seen rapid dispersal of astral energy in this area. It should all stabilize once density matches outside levels. The gate will be unable to sustain itself and will subsequently fade away. Mm. But hmm, a visitor from another time and space. Mm. If the Piker Curiosity has just you visit them while you can, they adhere to different standards than our own. No, I need to do some fine tuning to ensure that the time space separation occurs as slowly as possible. The last thing we'd want is for a sudden breakaway to leave a rift in its wake. Now that's a scary thought. This petition won't happen overnight, I should I should add it. I think it will take a while longer. <laughs> really? We should inform the siblings then that they will have a little longer together. And white years too. In the meantime, you're free to use the keys to come and go as you please. <laughs> Done me a, a great service. It's hardly fairly fair compensation, but take it. We got Mulas. this gate and key stuff is about but you gotta be a little crazy to do research inside a zoogle's stomach i don't care what he gets up to on his own time i'm just glad nothing crazy came out of all that in the end he mm -hmm. was trying to bridge together dimensions that in itself is rather <laughs> ludicrous i would argue yes still aizen was it it seems like that was the first he'd seen of his sister all grown up in that respect i'm glad it worked out for him Everything has a silver lining if you look hard enough. Doesn't change the fact that his little experiment was real dangerous. Extremely Look dangerous. From his perspective, I know if I got to see family I thought I never would again, that'd make me really happy too. Truth be told, I'm with Kisara on this. The ability to see those that you're afraid you've lost, even one more time. I hope it works out for them. There was also that Kronos guy we met at the end. Rather less. Yeah. What do you think his deal was? Yeah, he had those weird ears sticking out. <coughs> it's impossible to say whether he's like us or not. However, if we're to judge by his strength and appearance, he is clearly no ordinary being. Mm -hmm. And he's, what she said to Xi'an was deadly. Just, that was so awful. He most likely has his reasons for believing in what he does, even if they come from a very different place than what we ourselves know. He didn't seem to be too harsh on anybody who wasn't human, though. Ooh. It was all so strange. I wonder if we'll ever get to meet anybody else from other dimensions. Who can say? DLC. I pray it will be no, I'm joking. Friendly. I can only fight every <laughs> Not playing a DLC. For so long. It'd be nice to get a surprise <laughs> ally every once in a while. It's amazing, isn't it? We've been all over Dana on this journey. Is there anywhere we haven't visited at this point? Who knows? I'm being serious. We're talking about a whole planet here. Isn't it more exciting to just assume there are places we haven't seen yet? Uh, I picked the wrong guy to ask. Uh, what about you, Alfin? What do you think? That's a good question. I figure we visited just about every place civilization has set its eyes on. So is there anything left for us to see? That I couldn't say. You are talking about seeing an entire planet. Uh, yeah, I guess so. <gasps> this journey has proven just how little I truly knew our world. There is always more to learn. To assume otherwise would be the height of conceit. There might well be places that we still haven't discovered yet. And if you ask me, I think that's perfectly fine. Me too. We don't need to know every inch of Dana to fulfill our mission. Besides, 
I think there's something romantic about there still being mysteries out there. I'd say it's part of the fun to imagine whether we'll be the first to uncover those mysteries. Maybe even now there are other explorers who will shed a light in the darkest places. True! I guess the world's bigger than any of us will ever really realize. You know, I was just saying the same thing as Alfin. Why does she <laughs> listen to him and not me? Sounds like you've still got a lot to learn about the mysteries of a woman's heart.